Hey guys, it's Tia at B5Designs. Welcome to my channel. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for subscribing. I am on to share a little um, Dollar Tree haul. I went on the hunt for the new stamps and I think they have some dies that they've come out with. Um, I watched Kim at Kimmo Creations and she kind of hit the jackpot on that. So I wanted to go look for them and did not find anything in my stores. Now I have five stores in my town that I know of, kind of within, I don't know, 20 mile radius, I guess. And uh, I didn't really find anything, um, but I will show you what I picked up. As far as dyes, I did get this one and I think this one's been out for a while. Um, my stores are kind of usually late to the party, so I don't get, and sometimes we, you know, like all Dollar Trees, sometimes we don't get any of the product that um, other people are. So if I do see something um, that I think I would use that I think is unusual, I do pick it up. But I don't go every week like I used to because I was buying stuff and it was just sitting and I ended up donating a lot of it and I just don't want to go down that path again um, but anyway I did get this one it was super cute they had it kind of in a weird place they didn't have it like normally they have their stamps <clears throat> with their um <clears throat> excuse me stickers hanging nicely and um they didn't they had this over with like the um, foam tape and um that kind of stuff which was weird for my store but whatever so I did get this one I think it's super cute I think it'd be cute cut out like in a rainbow pattern of paper and you could use it you know on the inside of card you use it however you want um, I did pick up two of these pens I'm gonna take them to work just to kind of know that they're mine this one's super cute because it's got let me take the sticker off I didn't notice this until actually just now as I am speaking. As you're looking at a blog screen there, but this one has, um, I don't think it shakes, but it's like a shaker or glitter filled. Isn't that so cute? And then one of these days, I keep saying this, but I have the stuff to make the pens, our little beaded pens which I've had for a very long time, a couple of years, and just never had the time to do it. And so I wanna make those for my coworker. I have two coworkers right now, but one is out because her daughter has, her very young 17 year old daughter has cancer. And that that's my supervisor, so. I'm hoping she gets to come back soon and things, you know, are going well. Um, I did find this elastic band. I thought I'd go ahead and pick it up. Um, I think the orange could be universal for me with having grandsons and granddaughters, but they'll be good for like TNs or I don't make TNs, but I do sometimes make little journaling books and um, I really enjoy creating mini albums. So I thought these might serve a good purpose. I got it in orange, pink, and of course the blue and the red. So I felt like the blue, the orange, and the red I can definitely use for both my grandsons, <coughs> excuse me, grandsons and granddaughter. Um, I picked up this file. I have one that I keep um, particular documents in uh, important documents in just, you know, not anything that needs to be locked in a safe, but important things. And then I wanted this one just for like, I'm going to say small bills that come in. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Like I like to pay my stuff as soon as it comes in. And then this way I can just put it in there. And I do have like miscellaneous, like, I don't know, physical therapy, copay or not copay, but bill or whatever um you know like one-time bills i can put them in there and get done with it or otherwise i have a file where i keep like the monthly bills anyway 
blah, 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 blah. I think at most everybody does that. Um, I did find this little DIY macrame rainbow, and I do know that there's been many, many tutorials on this on YouTube and Serenity Creations. Anna um, did, has some really good, she's really good, um, with tutorials and so I do have all the stuff to actually make these myself that I've had for a couple of years I'm looking right at it <laughs> and I just never had the time so I have more time now I'm more settled I think and my hours at my work so um, I also found this and this is um, in insert cards like if you have a Cricut Joy and it has two really nice thick foil pages, two really nice um, textured cardstocks in red, and then you get four cards, one, uh, two cream and two in pink, and then you get the envelopes. So I thought that was cool. I haven't seen anybody haul that, but I haven't been watching a ton of hauls. So, okay, so... They did have a lot of rub-ons. Some of this I may have seen before or may have even, but I got these like dandelion ones. I think they're so cute. I love rub-ons. And then um, the butterflies. These I like to use in my junk journal, which I've been kind of neglecting my junk journals. Um, these are rub-ons as well, and it's cool to be kind today. I like stuff like that. I like to put stuff on my notebooks too. Um, hashtag best day ever. Uh, the uh, feathers with be happy and dream until your dreams come true these would be good like on a graduation card too or something and then I picked up this iron on uh, iron on art not sure what I'm gonna do with it but I liked it and this one says Queen this one says faith so this could definitely go in my faith journal and then this one says blessed. I really liked that. And then I picked up, let me get this out of the way, a couple of notebooks for work. Of course, you know, I'm on the strawberry lover's kick. And look at, I like to just have something small. A lot of times I use post-its to just write things. Because sometimes I forget um, what someone has said to me. or it, it, It's just the process of how my job works taking in a lot of doing a lot of intake while sitting with someone and sometimes I just forget and I liked this one because it says actually I bought this one because I liked this and now I see it said don't I see that it said I knew that it said don't be afraid to just believe but I didn't realize that it was uh, mark 536 so I don't yeah the whole thing is that but it's really super cute so that'll be nice to have at my desk to scribble things down and I do that you know taking messages or if I have questions I'll write them down so I can ask the day the next day um, or when someone's around and that is oh and the other thing that I went ahead and picked up is this mermaid wreath form and um, I got it because my living room is in like a beach slash nautical theme and I know I seen somebody do something with it they also have a shell and I thought well I'm gonna get this so if I see something I will make it and that is it for Dollar Tree and I will be back with some online hauling in a minute 